What's going on, Rachel Boy? CJ, aka the Beard Yerk, and I'm back again with another episode of the Barbershop Files. If you've been here before, thanks for coming back. I really appreciate the support. If you haven't been here before, make sure you click that subscribe button. It's right down below. Smash that like button, ring that bell, drop me a comment. It really helps out the channel. In the meantime, sit back, relax, enjoy this intro, and I'll be right back. Are you ready? And I'm back. Thanks for sticking around. So, as you can tell from the title, from the thumbnail, today's barbershop file is going to be on Mudcat Whiskers. So, Mudcat Whiskers is out of Lafayette, Louisiana, owned by a gentleman by the name of Nick. Uh, I actually was fortunate enough to win this combo in a giveaway. Uh, I got the one ounce oil and a four ounce butter. Uh, the scent for his barbershop um, that he makes is called Rain. Um, so, the one ounce oil runs for $14 on his website and the four ounce butter runs for $20 on his website. So if you get this in a combo, um, you save yourself a dollar and it's $33 for them in a combo. Um, I do not have one, but there are several gentlemen in the community that have discount codes. Um, so you can definitely search that out, save yourself a little bit more money and support those guys as well. So getting right into it, um, the one ounce oil you have right here, you can say you got the company name on the front as well as the set profile name on there as well. And then you come along the side and then you have your directions as well as your ingredients with yourself a little viewing window on the side as well. It's a nice amber bottle with the dropper top and then the oil has kind of a light golden tint to it and it's definitely on the lighter to medium viscosity. So very, very nice. Um, getting into the carrier blend. Uh, the carrier blend in the oil is golden jojoba oil, virgin hemp seed oil, Moroccan argan oil, vitamin E, and then a blend of essential and fragrance oils. So again, I've been talking about this for the past couple weeks. I'm starting to notice it more and more. Another company that's putting all the benefits and what these oils are doing for your face and your beard on their website. I love this. Very, very good information for anybody, whether you're new or you've been growing a beard for 30 years. This is information that everybody likes to see and likes to know. So very, very good job. I like that a lot. Um, the oil worked absolutely amazing for my beard. As always, that hemp seed in there, something that I always search out for in an oil and beard soaked it up nice and, you know, nice and good and worked absolutely amazing for the skin underneath. So very, very good job. Like that a lot. So getting into the butter, the four ounce butter, as you can see, you have the company name on there as well as the scent profile name, and then well, as well your ingredients and directions. So this butter is a very smooth, very nice butter. Like it a lot. As you can see, I've used quite a bit of it. So very, very nice. It is in that glass jar. So I apologize if I mispronounce any of these, but there are some ingredients in here that I have not actually seen before. So the butter's carrier blend is Takuma butter, sal seed butter, kupuwaka butter, babasu oil, cucumber seed oil, castor oil, tamanu oil, meadow foam seed oil, jojoba oil, hemp seed oil, and argan oil. Again, there you have it posted all the ingredients, what they do, what they are doing to benefit your beard and your skin. Very, very nice. This butter worked absolutely amazing for my beard. Very nourishing and conditioning. Exactly what it is used, is needed for. It worked very, very well. So getting into the scent. So the scent on the website is listed as a clean, refreshing talcum powdery with a spice. So this kind of reminds me of when I smell this being at the barbershop and you know, you always kind of get that powdery scent like you had just gotten a shave or you're just getting cleaned up. Well, this kind of has more to that scent. It reminds me of also getting maybe your hair or even your beard washed. It adds that clean, refreshing scent to it as well. I absolutely loved it. Very, very nice. Um, one thing I do want to talk about though, I don't think this is a bad thing. I actually, once I tried it, kind of liked it. So the oil, if I wore the oil alone, so I, normally what my schedule is, I will wear 
put oil in the morning, oil on the morning, and then wear butter at night. That is six out of seven days of the week. If I'm doing something for work or something else is going on, I will use balm very rarely, or sometimes I will add butter in the morning as well. Very rarely though, but like I said, there are some situations that I do that. But like I said, six out of seven days, just oil in the morning and butter at night. And the reason why I'm telling you this is because the oil, very good. The scent lasted eight to 10 hours, it was definitely an all day scent, um, worked outside, wore it on the weekends, you know, no matter what got a solid day's worth of scent out of this. So the butter, the butter scent is very mild. So I can actually smell the carrier blend um, products um, over the scent at times. So the reason why I say this isn't a bad thing is like I, is why I told you my schedule. I mostly wear butter at night. So if I were to put this on at night, it is not overpowering. It's not going to sit there and, you know, upset my wife because it's so strong. You know, when I'm trying to go to bed, it's very mild. I like it a lot. When I pair these two together, it works fine. I can't, I can't smell those carrier blends. That scent is very strong. And again, when I pair them together, I get that solid 10 hours. But when I wear just the butter alone, that scent is, it's very, very mild. So it works great. It works great for when I wear it at night and I'm going to bed. I don't have anything that's overpowering, keeping me awake, keeping the wife awake, annoying anybody. So very, very nice. That's why I say that that is a positive. So kudos for that. Um, good job, Nick. Um, like that a lot. So I mean, Nick offers several things on the website. Uh, make sure you check it out. Uh, he's got sample packs, oils, butters, balms, um, wash, conditioner, you name it. So I will definitely post um, a link to his website as well as his Instagram down below in the description. Uh, make sure you check that out. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you do so now. It's a button right down below. And thanks for checking it out and stay tuned for next week. Thank you.